So that kind of wraps up the song, really. Um, in terms of form, um, starts with the riff. Into the first, first, and the heat pipe shake. Personification of the, of the house, always bear that in mind. It's, uh, the riff is setting the scene for the house. It's just like that monotonous grind, bam, bam, bam. But only when I'm alone. And then into the chorus. Do that again, verse, chorus. A uh, little break, then for the drop down verse. I don't want to change things around, but I really think that we should. It's the most personal part of the song, lyrically, so r really quiet on here. I think on the record, actually, I think it go goes to another instrument. I think it just goes to the Rhodes piano and it just, I drop out. But if you're, if you're playing it on guitar, just, it wants the riff, but just very gentle. And then, uh, mother saw that I was feeling down. She asked me if I'd try Feng Shui. And then in again, open it out a bit more. She also asked me what I feel inside. I said there wasn't any more to say. Into the last chorus, and, um, and then a little riff, I think three times round to end. Um, very simple, uh, but. Showing that, I think Dadgad works pretty pretty well on the electric. Don't be afraid to capo up, but just make sure that you spend a bit of time on your tuning, I guess, because uh, it behaves slightly differently. <laughs>